Hi friends, you're watching uh, Movie Reviews with uh, Raghuram. In this video, I'll be speaking about uh, and also reviewing uh, Shamshera, uh, which is uh, premiering on uh, Amazon Prime Video. Uh, Shamshera features uh, Ranbir Kapoor in a dual role. Father uh, Ranbir Kapoor and uh, son is also Ranbir Kapoor. Father is a decoit and uh, son also plays uh, the decoit in the later half uh, of the movie. They also have a very intimidating villain in the form of uh, Doroga Shuddh Singh, <laughs> uh, played by Sanjay Dutt. But very interesting for me is uh, the way the director of the movie has uh, used the crows in the movie, plenty of crows. They keep uh, visiting the movie every now and then, plenty of crows just like that to save our uh, hero. So watch out for the story of uh, the crows in uh, the movie. I haven't seen any movie uh, wherein crows have been... Uh, used to such uh, effective proportions or such uh, big proportions the vfx uh, involving the crows is uh, really bad in couple of instances they really come once when uh, uh, bali that is uh, the junior uh, ranbir kapoor uh, jumps from uh, uh, a hill into the water uh, at that particular point also plenty of crows uh, come to save him and uh, point number two is the climax again uh, a lot of crows come uh, to uh, save and protect and help uh, our uh, protagonist Ranbir Kapoor that is uh, junior uh, uh, Ranbir Kapoor Akha Bali. But very interesting thing for me was uh, the most intimidating person in the movie uh, that is uh, Sanjay Dutt uh, playing uh, the role of uh, Daroga, Daroga uh, Shud Singh. He doesn't uh, get feared by any, anybody. So in fact, uh, uh, Daroga uh, Shud Singh itself is a name of scare, name of panic. Uh, so he creates uh, havoc in uh, the minds of uh, almost all the people uh, in the movie. Uh, his cruelty, his uh, fun plus intimidating angle. Uh, uh, so he scares a lot of people. But uh, I wonder, uh, so why he was scared of this cross in the climax of the movie? Uh, would uh, the movie makers uh, bring a spin-off uh, so as to why the Rogo Shud Singh was scared of crows. Here we are speaking about crows more than the movie or the antagonist or the protagonist. Uh, crows are very uh, important part of this particular movie. Uh, it looked funny. Uh, so this particular concept, uh, plenty of crows coming in. And also an even fresh concept again as I said, uh, the VFX involving the crows uh, uh, should have been better. So, Shamshera is uh, the story of uh, a decoit uh, Shamshera, uh, father uh, Ranbir Kapoor, why he had uh, become uh, decoit, why his tribe had to become decoits. Uh, uh, you will come to know when you watch uh, the movie, especially the first 20-25 minutes of uh, the movie uh, carries the story of uh, uh, father Ranbir Kapoor as uh, Shamshera and then the rest of the movie is about uh, the son, Bali, who also becomes uh, the junior Shamshera in the second part of uh, the movie. Uh, why he becomes Shamshera, why he too has to become decoit. So that uh, that story is covered in uh, the majority part of uh, the movie, apart from the first 25 minutes. So when his uh, mother, Bali's mother, narrates the story of Shamshera and tells how uh, he was their leader and was not a traitor and how he was, uh, he and his tribe, including her, including Bali, everybody, the tribe of uh, Shamshera were cheated by the Roga uh, Shud Singh and they were uh, uh, captured in a fortress and how British were involved in that. So I forgot to tell that uh, this story runs uh, during the British era and uh, uh, Sanjay Dutt is playing uh, the role of the cop uh, who is uh, the police working uh, for uh, the British forces. So when Bali's mother narrates the story of Shamshera, uh, Shamshera has uh, uh, many things to achieve. Number one, he has to flee from the fortress. Number two, he has to get the support of the other people outside the fortress. Number three, he has to prepare a blueprint so as to combat uh, the Roga Shud Singh and uh, the British army or the British forces. And last but not the least, uh, free his people from the captivity, from where they are captured inside the fortress. So can Bali achieve this? No prizes for guessing. Uh, you will come to know when you watch this uh, movie. So coming to the positives of uh, the movie, Ranbir Kapoor, uh, acting wise, really good. Father Shamshera, son Samshera, two different uh, characters, that is Father Samshera and uh, Bali, the son, two different characters, two different shades. Uh, one a serious character father, the second one is a more, more of a jovial and zindadilla type of person, having a lot of fun playing with kids, uh, uh, doing a, a plenty of uh, st stupid things. At the same time, he is uh, being trained by uh, Ronit Rai for some adventures uh, and he is also romancing with uh, Vani Kapoor. He is singing songs, doing a lot of things until his mother narrates uh, the story of uh, uh, his father so we can see a transition in his uh, character so Ranbir Kapoor's uh, acting 
is uh, good in the movie uh, in both these uh, roles uh, the father and the son's roles he has come good he's a good actor so one thing uh, the movie gave a clarity especially after watching the serious uh, uh, tones of uh, his character as father and also in uh, uh, some portions as a son in the second half of the movie uh, i learned that uh, ranbir kapoor can do much more than what exactly he is what he has done till today he ha- he can do those intense roles also he can do those serious roles also apart from being a lover boy or uh, a chocolate boy those avatars so ranbir kapoor is also trying things uh, so like uh, shamshara beat uh, brahmastra is trying different things ranbir kapoor's uh, role is good uh, sanjay dutt uh, as uh, droga uh, shut singh is intimidating he also looks uh, funny uh, i i missed uh, amrish puri in this uh, I, i was just uh, imagining i was just visualizing amrish puri in this particular character of droga shut singh how effective it uh, could have been uh, sanjay dutt is okay uh, so he has also done uh, a decent job as uh, droga shut singh intimidating uh, cruel with uh, a little bit of a funny and a cringy character he is and then uh, we have ronit roy ronit roy has uh, an extended role and uh, he has also really come good saurabh shukla i have to mention fantastic role watch out for him saurabh shukla's role is simply superb in the movie and uh, the female uh, protagonist uh, the so called heroine vani kapoor uh, was as good as not there in the movie she comes here and there uh, dances a couple of times and at the end she gets uh, pregnant uh, to uh balis a child uh, not a big role not a significant role nothing to remember nothing important i should tell about vani kapoor she's there or not doesn't matter in the movie again the romance uh, or the romantic angle between uh, ranbir kapoor and vani kapoor too has not come uh, really good uh so apart from that song fitur fitur uh, is beautifully uh, pictureized song beautiful beautifully pictureized one of the beautifully pictureized song and arijit's voice was simply a uh, fabulous just watch out for that song ji huzur that song was also all fun i just uh, allowed the mood and tone of uh, that particular song also anyhow i am speaking about uh, the songs and the music and uh, mithun's music is good uh, so the next positive thing of uh, the movie is uh, the technicalities uh, technically the movie is uh, good uh, i should tell more than good itself uh, i ha- i need to tell the cinematography is uh, simply superb uh, the top angle shots especially uh, when shamshara and his uh, a uh, tribe is uh, riding the horses uh, those uh, desert uh, sequences or uh, the outdoor locations uh, wherever the movie has been pictureized uh, the top shots uh, the close uh, close in camera shots everything the camera work and also the cinematography is simply superb the background music is uh, uh, decently good and uh, matches with the tone of uh, the movie the color and the light gradient uh, in the movie is also good and also the costumes the attire uh, everything is uh, so technically technically the movie uh, is good action choreography coming to the action choreography there are a couple of action sequences they could have been better much better uh, uh, in the movie because action was playing a very important role in uh, the movie shamshera and uh, same feel i have about the vfx vfx uh, too should have been uh, uh, much more better so especially take that uh, train sequence which comes at uh, uh, the climax uh, that 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 was looking like a horrible vfx uh, it could have been done in a better way so coming to the negativities of the movie there are plenty of negativities in the movie the length of the movie itself is uh, the biggest uh, negative factor it's almost around 2 hours 40 minutes and uh, patience testing the first half of the movie uh, is is okay because it has uh, different elements it has uh, a fun it has romance it has action it has a, a flashback story of uh, shamshera and uh, the current story of uh, bali and lot more things uh, happening and uh, once it the second half of the movie comes the story becomes too 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 predictable and uh, you know the storyline where exactly the story is going how exactly this movie is going to end so everything is predictable nothing is new so no twists and turns so no adventure or no uh, action so, uh, so songs are also not really impressive so they just keep coming and disturbing uh, uh, even whatever mood of uh, the story is there the story is not great uh, it's a thin line wafer uh, line story as i already said uh, so since the story is uh, not too good the screenplay is also uh, not good at all so so overall overall the length of the movie the story uh, tried and tested formula a predictable storyline the screenplay so especially very dull screenplay in the second half all these things add to the negative uh, aspects of the movie yes to add uh, to the story and screenplay as i was uh, already talking uh, the story seems to be totally outdated 20 25 years ago this story uh, coming might have made a difference uh, uh, for the viewers and also uh, those who want to watch uh, uh, such adventure movies and also so for this particular where we stand in 2022 uh, the story seems to be totally outdated a father son story father is a decoit a son coming to take the revenge and avenge his uh, f- uh, father's death and all those things uh, uh, seems to be totally outdated 
overall to put it in short i can tell uh, the performances were good uh, uh, and then uh, technically also the movie was uh, decent enough um, so the length of the movie even if the length of the movie would have been short uh, it would not have contributed to the success of the story because as i said the story is outdated the screenplay the story everything should be worked out uh, so uh, karan malhotra i think he uh, uh, missed missed the train in uh, making this particular movie he missed the plot uh, he missed the pulse of the audience so finally i can tell uh, it disappointing uh, movie from uh, the house of uh, ashraj films strong recommendation for this movie shamshara if you are a hardcore ranbir kapoor fan if you are a hard kapoor sanjay dat fan or if you are a hardcore vani kapoor fan you can watch this movie i'll still go with a decent uh, 5 out of 10 for uh, shamshara thanks for watching my video if you loved my video can you like share and subscribe to my channel I'll catch up with you all in my next video with another movie review until then do take care goodbye namaste